Right now, jurors are deliberating in the double murder trial of disgraced former South Carolina attorney Alex Murdoch. He's pleaded not guilty to killing his wife and youngest son. Gloria Pazmino has you covered on the closing arguments. First off this morning, the defense for Alec Murdoch Thursday presenting to jurors their argument for reasonable doubt. What we know is um, three out of those four things that, that you're going to be deliberating on for the, the indictments that return aren't true. No blood spatter, no, no GSR rain jacket that, that's ever been connected to Alex whatsoever, and there's no loaded gun. So we're left with the lie. During the six weeks of testimony, Murdoch admitting on the stand he lied to investigators about where he was on the night his wife Maggie and son Paul were murdered. Murdoch acknowledging it's his voice in the background of a video Paul took at the family's dog kennels moments before he and Maggie were killed there. The defense says that doesn't prove Murdoch murdered his wife and son. Attorney Jim Griffin replaying witness testimony for the jury. He, he adored her. He, he loved her. He adored her. The defense asserting law enforcement, quote, failed miserably in investigating this case. Why did they never take DNA samples off of Maggie's clothes, her dress? Why did they never take DNA samples off Paul's clothes? The prosecution getting the last word. Richard Alexander Murdoch, who was lied and lied and lied and lied, and it's been okay. We respectfully request it stops here today. No, it's not okay. In Walterboro, South Carolina, I'm Gloria Pasmino reporting.